Hi guys, Vex here. Welcome back to Windforge. And I wanted to make I wanted to make one more video about this game cuz I felt I was unfair to it when I was critical of the mining. I have since learned something about the mining that uh, makes things a bit more tolerable and actually, you know, kind of enjoyable. Uh, I also wanted to show off but, wow, okay. Uh, I also wanted to show off uh, shipbuilding. And what has happened to my ship, Davian Prime, here. Uh, you're not really restricted. At first I thought you had to build on top of their uh, lattice work. You can make your ship... That's not true. You can make your ship look like whatever you want to. And I actually have plans for a ship later on. Uh, maybe I'll make a video... Well, maybe I'll make a video about that if I ever build that ship. Uh, of putting the Zeppelin balloon down lower, and then building the ship around the central balloon, because it's the most vulnerable thing. Uh, but right now, I've used stone, because stone is actually a pretty decent, cheap, early game armor block. Uh, I also wanted to show you guys something else here. The propel This propeller is actually obstructed. It's 14% obstructed. So... One of the first things I tried to do was cover in propellers. Let me delete that stone block, and now it's open again. But you can't you can't cover up the propellers. You need to actually let them function realistically and blow air uh, for them to work. The Zeppelin, however, the Zeppelin balloon, uh, you could totally cover that up, and I've fully armored that in stone. And this layer of stone right here on the bottom, that is in case the Zeppelin ever does explode. The, that'll stop the fire. You know what? I'll show that off. I'll, let me quick save first before I show that off. Uh, and I've got some ship storage here. I don't want to pilot the ship yet. Ship storage. There we go. Your stash. I've just been kind of farming, flying around. I haven't advanced the quest line at all. Uh, now, one thing about if I if I did try to LP this game, I would pretty much ruin the story for you guys. So that's actually a pretty good reason for me to not LP it so that, you know, you can buy the game yourself and, and enjoy the story without it being uh, spoiled for you. Because, uh, like, compared to Minecraft, Minecraft is like a sandbox game. There really is no story to spoil. But there's a story to this game. And uh, I've just been doing... Uh, I've been Skyriming my way around. Uh, I've uh, done side quests. I haven't really advanced the main quest yet. But so, yeah, you can armor... Uh, I've been using stone as an armor block. It is heavier than wood, and I can feel that sluggishness start to kick in after a while. Uh, but let me show you why I'm using stone. Let me take out my rifle here. Let's shoot one of these armored... Uh, these are actually these are actually armored wood blocks. <clears throat> so let's just shoot one. Um, one, two, three... Three hits destroys the reinforced wooden block there. Let me repair that. Alright, let me take my rifle back out. And let's shoot at one of these. Let's get this one. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, nope. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so five on that one. I think the uh, that may have been that may have been previously damaged in a fight. But yeah, it's, it's five, uh, five shots for the stone, three shots for the wood, and so, you know, it's, it is better. Uh, it is better as an armor block, even though it is heavier, but I've got plenty of uh, propulsion power here, so the heaviness doesn't really bother me too much. Uh, so yeah, that's my, uh, that's my ship right now, and I've got machine gun turrets here in the side. So uh, these are quite powerful so far against the early game enemies uh, I've fought. And instead, of, in addition to manually aiming them, uh, they're also manned when you... Uh, I don't want to shoot the left... I don't want to shoot this one on the right side because I don't want to hit the town. But uh, this one on the left side, I actually switch between them. I, I think I can aim up safely. And uh, thankfully, ammunition for this has been pretty cheap for me to buy. Whoa, oops. Nope, go up. Alright, I want to show you guys something else here. I think I'll, I'll... Let me put my... 
airship down here. There we go. Uh, I don't know why I'm... Well, actually, I probably should repair this. Alright, let's... Uh, I want to show you guys... This will, this will be kind of funny to watch as well. Uh, why I have armored this the way I have. You idiot! Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. I don't, I don't want this guy to die. And he's being an idiot, and he's he's running. <gasps> when was the last time I saved? Okay, there we go. Uh, when my ship crashes, I'll just land on this poor person's house. Uh, let's do a little quick save there, because I'm definitely not going to want to have this be a permanent thing. Uh, the reason I have this thing here, I want to show you guys how this serves as a fire break. <clears throat> Uh, and also the reason, how effective, so how effective is armoring the Zeppelin? Uh, this is a pretty powerful gun. At least, this is the most powerful gun I could get my hands on at this stage of the game. Alright, I am just, I am just now finally hitting, uh, the Zeppelin here. And the, the Sky Pirates I've been fighting uh, aren't nearly as accurate with their shots. They're not going to know to dr keep drilling the same spot. Uh, so the Zeppelin is very well protected uh, with that stone. Uh, so I think what I can do is come out here, latch on, and up we go. Okay. So I'm going to use my jackhammer. And that is the fastest way to... Now, I think right there, I could... Yes. Yeah, you could use your repair tool, uh, if you see that, catch fire, and stop it. You could actually stop that from uh, burning down if I catch it soon enough. There we go. So this is going to uh, eventually explode. And when it does... There it goes. But, uh, so even though some in some areas the fire got through three layers of stone, it was not, because of, I had the stone there, it was not nearly as bad as it would have been. Uh, it would have, the fire would have gone all the way through the ship and just gutted it. Uh, the engines, the propellers down there, I'd be in really bad shape. Oh dear. Oh wow. <laughs> Yeah, this game's kind of awesome. Uh, what happens if I just start shooting the town? Huh. Nobody really seems to care. I guess it's really my loss because these towns people can do nothing but help me. So, uh, let's load that quick save. Alright, uh, now that I've showed off the things I wanted to show you with the ship, uh, I figure the last thing I wanted to do is, well, not, not, no, not my stash. There we go. Let's go and fly to where I've been kind of farming resources. I want to show you guys just some of the, like, day-to-day gameplay. Let's hit that loading screen. Loading screens aren't too bad. Let's see if I can fly around and get into a, a fight with another a pirate, an enemy pirate airship. Let's see. Yeah, this is that, that down there where all it's, you can see it's been mined. I've been mining uh, down there. Uh, wait a minute. I heard something. I think that was dirt. <laughs> Uh, you're not what I want to fight. You're just kind of a nuisance. Go away. Alright, shot him down. Yeah, the creatures don't seem to be very, very useful to fight. I'm trying to make some money here. And the best way i found to make money so far is to... Let's see. Find enemy airships. Wait, there's one over there, I think. Yep, there's one. Okay. 
Check out this strategy. All right, watch closely. This is the best way I found to make money early on. You fly right on up to these guys, and they start shooting, but you get there. Oh, wait, 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 don't leave, don't leave. Nah, I'm just kidding. I think, did that one guy just kill the other? That's funny. So he's shooting, but uh, he's not gonna go. Go away, Basilisk. Now. No, I don't want to hit the balloon. I do not want to hit their balloon. There we go. That's what I wanted. Now you stop. Go away. Yeah, fly into the fly into the propellers. Get killed by that. All right, there we go. <clears throat> All right. Now that the crew of the enemy craft is dead, their ship. Oh, hold on a sec. Oh my gosh! What the hell, game? I'm trying to make a video here. Get off my ship! Get off my ship, you little turd! Get off! Get. He's just walking around up there on top of my ship. Come on down here. Gotcha. Butt mongrel. Okay. <clears throat> what was I trying to do? Before I was so rudely interrupted by, you know, every animal in the universe. Uh, usually it's not this busy. It's, apparently I just start recording and every animal comes just comes out of the woodwork to... Uh, let me repair my stuff before we go over there, just so I don't forget. I like how easy it is to repair your ship. You just wave your repair thing around and it just gets done. Alright, so I'm going to take out my dismantle tool, which is 9. And we are going to jump onto their ship. There we go, be careful. And I think I might go ahead and repair their ship too to make sure it doesn't blow up on me while I'm standing on it. Uh, we're going to take the bandit's drops. And then I want this, I want this like almost kind of docked, basically. Whoa, this thing is fast. And also... There we go. And so I'm going to take out my dismantle tool, which is 9 right now, and I'm just going to dismantle it. So there's an iron propeller. There's a... No! No! That way. Wow, this thing is so light that even me running around on it... Uh, so I'm going to take off that, that. Uh, and we're going to get off that thing and go back to my ship and kill this stupid... There. Alright. Okay. Uh, oh my gosh, look what he did to the... Jibba jabba, jibba jabba. Rabble. Alright. Where did that, uh... Where did that airship go? Has anybody seen it? Did it... Did it fly through the loading screen and probably get deleted from the game world? Yeah. Uh, all I was going to do is... Oh my gosh! Whoa, heads up! I've never seen that before. Ever. Okay, so you'll get something new on this video. Well, this person looks mean. Alright, let's go ahead and take out that gun. There we go. Uh, that ship has no balloon on it. Wow. Okay then. Let's see if I can take out the pilot. Got him. Oh wait, come back here. Don't leave. I want to loot your ship. That's a very interesting design. There he goes. Oh, there was somebody in the other turret, apparently? Got him. Alright, that's... Is that all three of them dead? Okay. Is it going to stabilize? Let's see if this thing stabilizes. How about you don't come here? How about you just die? How about that? I kind of almost want to get, like, maybe right here. Alright. I need to get over there and stabilize that ship, because I want everything aboard that ship. I want everything aboard there. Okay, 
But you know what? Maybe I shouldn't actually repair the... You know what? Let's quick save right here in case I do something stupid. Uh... Wow. If I... Okay, let's go in. Is this thing still... Uh... Tell you what... Uh, is there a place I can land this ship? Oh... Dang. Okay, what should... What's the best way to proceed here? Alright, let's stop it here. Definitely gonna swing that repair gun around and repair all this. Okay. Alright. This is a this is a very interesting design. It's being held up by those two propellers over there, I believe. And I guess it works because it doesn't weigh very much. <clears throat> Uh, I won't lie, like, not having a Zeppelin makes me slightly uneasy. Mm. There's that, Honestly, the reason I put these, like, walls here in front of this propeller is not to uh, protect it so much as just to keep me from running into it when I jump back aboard my ship. Okay, let's go back to the bridge. And I think what I can do is push... The, well, can I grab it under here and push it up? Can I push it over there? I can't quite move it. Can I bump it up? I'm trying to push it so that it uh, comes to rest. There we go. Okay. Alright, now, uh, let's see. Can I go ahead and dismantle the destroyed objects? Or do I need to repair them first? And then take them? Yeah, there we go. I took them. And then, uh... So I kind of want the engines. What are these? Medium steel propellers? Can I take the, uh... Okay, I can take that. Take the control panel. I just took the control panel. Background iron blocks. Yeah, I want to take all this. I definitely want to come down here and take these two... Can I take your banner? No. I definitely kind of want to take these things, the steel propellers up here. I'm going to take all this. If I take this, alright, I took the steel diesel engine. Oh, this is great. I'll be able to upgrade my ship with all this stuff. Take the door. What is this, driftstone block? Background iron? Oh, 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 shh! Shh, 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 Okay, okay, calm down. Oh my god, that about gave me a heart attack. Okay, um... I'm pretty sure as soon as I grab, uh... Yeah, I can just basically just wave this around and strip the enemy ship of components. And as soon as I grab, I'm pretty sure as soon as I grab that engine, it's going to plummet. If I take these things, take the engine. Okay. And I think what's going on here is it's... It's now like putting pressure on my ship here. So if I come over here... If I start taking this, got to be careful not to nick my ship. Okay, that's enough. Let's pull out from it. Oh, is it stuck onto me? It looks like it's stuck on me. Let me try ramming it against the ground here. Oh, there we go. There it goes. Okay, and that's the last... Uh... Oh, look at that. There's a pirate ship. It's a tiny pirate vessel right above me. Just They were being very polite and waiting on me to get done here. Let's say, quick save that. I definitely don't want to lose that progress. Save early, save often. Um, by the way, if you fall into the void, it's not guaranteed death. It happened to me earlier, and what I did was, as I fell by one of these islands, I grappled onto it and climbed on, and I was separated from my airship, 
But in your uh, inventory here, you have a, uh, what's it categorized as? Oh, quest. A radio. Basically, this teleports you back to town when you use it. The only caveat is that uh, I think you can't be in combat, but otherwise it just teleports you back to town. Alright, so we've got it. Let me shut the doors. Everything is secure. So we we pretty much got steel propellers. I can replace the other stupid crude propellers. They're, wow, they're good quality too. Six of them. And uh, steel diesel engine? Wow. Okay, yeah, that's, that's going to provide some great upgrades for my ship. I've never seen a, a ship like that before. Let's come up here. Hi, guys. Thank you for waiting patiently. I appreciate that. Wow, they, uh, they cooperated. And it's nice that no animals have shown up while I've been trying to do this. All right, there we go. We're pulled up right alongside them. Dismantle tool out. Hop on. And take their drops. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's use the control panel. And dismantle that and that. And kind of want the engine too and the control panel. And I'm currently encumbered. Well, that's okay. I like how I can jump, kind of jump on this thing and... Uh-oh. And there it goes. Well, great. Oh, no, 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 not into the propeller. Okay, there we go. Well, I didn't get the balloon, but the balloon's not really that important, I don't think. So that thing's going to drift away and despawn, I assume, once it hits the loading screen. All right, so that's the ship combat and, like, salvaging gameplay that I wanted to show off. Now that we've gotten that done, there's one more thing I want to show that I, I felt like I didn't give the game a fair shake. And I want to I want to set that right before... I sign off. You've got to be kidding me. Alright, we'll just try to ignore them for right now since they're above us and they seem to not be able to target uh, down too much. So I'm going to take out my jackhammer. So here's the... Uh, oh, there's some rifle ammo there. Um, I'm encumbered. Hold on one sec. Let me go jump in here. View the stash. Oh, I got, I got two more machine gun... Oh, I got two more machine gun turrets. That's awesome. All right, let's throw this. Uh... Let's just throw all this into my uh... stash here, and that'll uh, get us unencumbered. We can jump back up here. So the mining. The way I was mining before was trying to target everything, every block I wanted to mine. The best way to mine in this game is... This is basically kind of like a weapon, and it shoots constantly at anything in front of it. So if you want to mine something, all you got to do is just... It doesn't matter where your crosshair actually is, just kind of point it at it, like that. See that? Look at that. Look at me just mining away the ground. And just, just drag your crosshair slowly back and forth, and uh, you mine pretty fast, actually. Uh... The advice I would give to Snowden Studios is let players know that, like that's the way to do it. Because people coming from Terraria, people coming from Minecraft, people coming from Starbound, all those games, they're going to try and actually click on the blocks to mine. And it was just by accident that I discovered, you know, this. Uh, this was the better way to mine. Uh, so be sure, to, be sure to tell players that so that they know. Because uh, I just figured it out on accident. And trying to, like, click on these blocks is really awkward. And so, but when I started out, I, I didn't know any better. Like, I didn't know not to do that. So, I would definitely make that part of the tutorial. Like, a, just leave a note or something in the tutorial. Uh, some sort of little, on one of the info cards you pop up in the tutorial. Um, I don't know. But, uh, overall, I'm, I'm really enjoying the game. Uh, the, the way the mining works now that I've figured out a different technique to use, it uh, makes mining a lot better. Uh, like, look at me just, just chopping right through this. 
So yeah, yeah, one of my uh, main complaints, uh, like on my first impression video, is not really relevant anymore. So, uh, I suppose in its place I should say, uh, try to let players know that that is the best way to mine. Because uh, this makes it, just dragging this around makes mining, so, oh my god, it makes mining so much easier. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get that sulfur, and I'm not gonna... I'm not going to jump cut or edit. I'm just going to show you the me going down here to get the sulfur, how easy it is. Like, just waving the mouse back and forth, and I'm already down here at the sulfur, and I, I got it. So, and this iron too, you know, I'll take this iron. Uh, so there you go. Uh, let me get this iron here. There we go. Is that, is that everything here? I think I, that's everything here. Uh, okay. We can head back to the ship. Oh, careful. We're a little encumbered, so I'm not jumping quite as high as I used to. And the bandits are still waiting. Wow, these bandits are so polite. These are the most polite bandits I've ever seen. Oh, no, 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 no. That was hitting my balloon. Don't let them do that. I think I can still ram them, though. You know what? Let's quick save just in case I do something really stupid. Hi, bandits. All right, you guys might be bandits, but I'm a sky pirate. Hi. Later. That person's like, nah, I'm not going to get machine gunned. I'm just going to take my chances trying to turn into a basilisk. They must have been... Uh... Maybe they were like this game's version of a werewolf or something. And they just turned into a basilisk. But they had to do it off screen because they didn't want to reveal their secret. Well, if that's the case, they just got machine gunned anyway, so. LOL, jokes on them. Alright, let's take this. Let's take this. Take it. Can I not take it because I'm encumbered? Oh, I'm using my repair gun. Haha, <laughs> I'm smart. Uh, nine. Take that. 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 This, the gun and thing and jump off there we go so that's how you quickly loot one of those ships and uh, that's about it for this video I think I I just wanted I wanted to show you the ship combat I wanted to show you the mining now that I now know what I'm doing and I really didn't know what I was doing before and I'm pretty sure there's uh, faster ways to mine later in the game uh, called a grinder I think it's an attachment for your ship and I don't know for 100% for sure, so take this with a grain of salt. But my gut tells me that it's an attachment for the ship, and you're just going to fly your ship into terrain and grind up blocks with it. I think that's probably how it's going to work. Uh, but yeah. Yeah, I really, really enjoy this. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I, uh, I really enjoy this game so far, and I need to heal up again. Food and meds. I've just been eating nuts, basically, to live off of. Because um, it's a cheap way to heal yourself. But yeah, I, I really like this game so far. So yeah, I'd give it my recommendation if you're interested in it. Uh, it's on Steam. Check the link. And I couldn't, I couldn't have it in my conscience knowing that my first video I complained about the mining. And then later on I figure out, oh, you can just sweep your mouse back and forth and it's super easy. Her her. Uh, I couldn't just have it on my conscience giving the game an unfair shake like that. So... Uh, yeah, I, I just wanted to set the record straight there and be fair to the game. And, uh, I've been playing it, playing it a lot. I don't, I don't think I'll LP it. I just don't want to, because if I LP it, all I'm going to do is spoil the story for everybody. And, uh, yeah. But I would recommend the game. I'm having a lot of fun with it, so. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Until then, take it easy.